Hello my lovies! Welcome back to my channel! Hello my lovies! Welcome back to my channel. Today we are grubbing down on some yummy Mexican food because you already know your girl loves her some Mexican food. Um, we got some... <laughs> my niece is in the background, excuse her. We got some flautas de carne, de viste. Um, it comes with a nice little salad. Um, and then I just have some tacos here. I have some carnitas tacos, I think. I think, I think, maybe. I don't know. I'm not sure. And some chorizo tacos. And then, of course, on the side, I have my salsa verde, my jalapenos, and some more salsa that they sent. Um, so let's get it in because you already know the deal. Your girl is starving. <laughs> See, this is how annoyed I am that even my good dater went. <laughs> She's um, angry. In the back, <laughs> I am angry. I'm just very annoyed today. Um, in the background is, are my sisters and my niece. If you are new to my channel, welcome to the fam bam, lovey. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on that post notification. <gasps> Enough babbling. It's been real. Oh, but you guys can't see it like that, so I'll leave it like that. Ooh, <laughs> I went sliding. Okay, so let's move that to the bike. Um, let's start with some flautas. So, oh, oh, I have a fork right here. I was gonna say I didn't bring anything to dig it out, you know. So, how are my lovies doing today? It is an ugly, ugly, gloomy day here in New York. Um, it looks like it wants to rain. I don't know, but it's whack. Um, I freaking hate the rain. Hate the rain. Hate when it's clouding. See, I don't like, like, hot, hot weather, but I also don't like when, um, it's, like, gloomy. I like the sun, and I like it to be, like, a little chilly. So, you know, like, fall, nice fall days works for me. Just saying. Let's get this one, because this one looks like it's... Sauced up. Oh, I should put the jalapenos over here so I stop crossing y'all. You know what I'm saying? Yay, yay. I'll give you guys the first bite and I'll be nice. Take the bite. Take it. Mmm. So bomb. I I have a cut on the side of my mouth. You know when you open your mouth too big, so it's when like killing me. To... I don't know. I went oh, to something. <laughs> <laughs> don't think nasty, guys. This over here, yes, it is. Mm -hmm. I'll be dirty in my throat. And then I wonder why I have so much laundry. I love, love there. Flautas. Hi right, guys, I have been dying and searching to go eat some tacos de birria, some birria tacos. And I finally found a spot here in Queens. There's like one spot only, <laughs> literally. Because your girl's been doing her research, okay? 
Um, oh, so this is like a thing? Yeah. Um, but it's a food truck, first of all. Their name of the food truck is Birra, Birria Landia. And the reviews are like fire. But they open at 5 p.m. So. I'm sure they stay open till like 4 in the morning, 5 in the morning, 4 in the morning. Mm -hmm. 3 a.m. Oh, 3 a.m. So, for me to do a video, it's a little harder because 5 p.m. already now, it starts getting late. So, I have to get like the lighting situation in my car good because I won't be able to go get it and then come home for it to still be hot. And with birria, it has to be like hot. Oh, what I know. So, I'm definitely working on a situation for you guys. I'm figuring it out. I'm going to make it happen. Because, for some reason, it's like my IG knows that I'm dying to have them. And I keep seeing all these videos on them. Because you searched it. Yeah, I did. <laughs> so... All these videos keep coming up, but they're of places all in L.A. And, like, I get it. You people in L.A. have popping food. All right, fine. Stop bragging, y'all. Tacos, that's it. Yeah. That's why it's all over. <laughs> I'm drinking water. All right, let's get one of these delicious tacos de chorizo. Yes, yes, yes. You guys, today, today... Well, by the time you guys see this, I'm going to hopefully post up the link down in my description below. Um, but today, Thursday, my sister is going live on a podcast. She's doing Venus versus Mars. She is going to... Hold on, let me just drip this real quick. Come on, taco. Oh, yeah. Look scrumptious. Yes, guys, I talk to my I talk to my food. You gotta make love to your food, you know? You gotta gotta show it love. The more love you show it, the better it treats you, you know what I'm saying? You don't really go to the bathroom like that. Uh just kidding. It has nothing to do with it, but you know, I like to believe. Uh excuse me. Oh, this one's like in there. Look at this. I'll be nice and give you guys the first bite again. Oh. Mouth drooling in the back. <sighs> mm. Yes, girl. Yes. One tap. They changed the chorizo. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's supposed to say bad. But they changed this type of chorizo. Excuse me, you were talking um, about me. I'm sorry. <laughs> I got distracted by a taco. So, my sister doing a podcast. Venus versus Mars. She gonna go. We're gonna air it on YouTube after. They're gonna go live on IG and Facebook. Um, as they're doing it, but they're gonna post it onto YouTube afterwards. So hopefully, I'm gonna put the link down in my description below so you guys could check it out. Um, if you guys follow me on IG, you probably see I've been posting about it. So go and check it out. She's gonna be holding it down for us, ladies. You know, typical guys that guys think that they could do certain stuff better like it's gonna be a whole bunch of stuff basically like guys versus girls you know trying to make now of what men, it's okay for men to do it's not okay for a woman to do uh -huh. society's perspective they're gonna be doing a little bit of everything so go and check it out show some love Tell them that I sent you. 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 Tell them that I
tell me that Christina sent you and Christina will send you a taco. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I could send you guys tacos. I wish I could hand stuff to you through the camera. Mm -hmm. Like, here, have a bite. This is, um, Mom. Bomb.com. So we're going to have a little story time i got a little sitch a little situation a little situation mm. whoa home I go to the gym every morning. Well, I try to, at least. For the most part, I do. Except Sundays. Sundays are my rest days. Um, sometimes when I'm not feeling good, obviously, I don't make it. But... For the past, I want to say... Of what I have noticed when I started noticing it for the past week. There is an old guy. Now, when I mean old, I mean grandpa is old. Okay? He has to be like at least in his early 70s. That's not that old. I thought he was going to say like 90s. Uh-uh. Maybe he is 90. Maybe he just looks good for his age because he goes to the gym. Who knows? He got that grandpa stamina. <laughs> so, in my gym, it's the... Elliptical machines in the front, and behind the elliptical machines are the treadmills. So it's like a row in a row. Okay, I always do a half an hour on the elliptical before I go do my weights and all that shit. You know, sometimes I'll do a full hour of cardio, whatever. In the front, on the wall, is a mirror. So, you basically could see each other, right? Because there's a mirror reflecting. I could see behind me, and they could see me through the mirror. Okay. You know when you look up at the mirror, and you kind of make eye contact with someone? Or in general, you make eye contact with someone? Whatever. I'm not going to lie. I usually have a stank face, but that's my natural quote-unquote bitch face, right? I have a resting bitch face. I can't help it. I don't know. So, like a week ago, I started noticing... That every time I look up, he's always staring at me, right? But not at me. Then I notice that he's pointing at something, right? Mind you, I go bright and early to the gym. I'm in the gym. My gym opens at 5 a.m. I'm in there at 5.30 a.m. Because one... I like to get it out of the way. Um, two, um, I find that it's less crowded because, you know, afterwards, the, the after work rush, whatever, starts going. So, when I'm on the elliptical, I'm usually always the only one on the elliptical machine. 
so one time there was another guy next to him on the treadmill and I see him pointing my direction, right? And they're both talking, whatever. And the old man has like a smile from ear to ear, right? So I don't pay much mind to it, whatever. It is what it is. Who knows? They could have been talking about what they did last night. I got laid. Did you get laid? Cool, cool. How was it? Good, good. Smile on my face. Okay, cool. I don't care. Then, same day, boom, that guy leaves, another guy comes. Because this, I mean, this old man, he... He goes on that treadmill for like an hour and a half, I feel like. I don't know. But now that I know the reason why he goes on that, I feel like I know that's why he goes on the treadmill for that long. So, um, you know, whatever. Another guy comes. Boom. You know. Cool. Again, I see like his finger pointing in my direction. So... At this point, I start feeling uncomfortable because I already know what he's pointing at, right? I turn around so I could somewhat make it known that I know what you're fucking pointing at. Like, we're not dumb. Like, okay, you're mad old. I'm old. Like, let's let's be real. What, we're, what you're pointing at, I know what you're pointing at, okay? So... I purposely, I fix my shirt. And I usually wear a long, a long shirt that covers um, my butt. Because, I mean, you know, I know there's just some, there's like, you know, guys that just can't control themselves. So, I usually do, but I can't all the time. I only own so many long shirts, people. <laughs> so, I had a regular, you know, regular shirt that went up to my hips. So, I ignore it, whatever, right? Just keep listening to my music, keep working out, cool. I finish, and um, when I get off of the, I forgot the name of the fucking machine now. Excuse my language, people. When I get off of my machine... I go to wipe it down because, you know, it's only right. It has my sweat on it. And I pass him to go downstairs to the weight training. And he, like, smiles at me. He says, hi. Don't. Now you're pissing me off and now you reassured exactly what you were looking at. And now you just pissed me off. So I just look at him and I'm like... And I just keep walking, okay? You gonna say hi? No. Because I know what he was doing. Thank you. I'm not gonna say hi and entertain an old pervy guy. I'm not gonna do it, no. So, um, I go downstairs, whatever. The next day, boom. I go again. And I always go to my, if my machine is available, I will go to my stain machine because I like that machine. It's perfect. It's not right underneath the fan. I'm not going to get sick. Like, it's the perfect one. I figured this out, guys. It's all calculated. So, I look behind me. Well, what do you know? Who's there? Grandpa likes to stare a lot. <laughs> so, stare a lot. <laughs> he sees me, right? We both make eye contact in the mirror. <laughs> Ew, Matt, uncomfortable. I just, so, saw, I just saw a picture of it in my head. So uncomfortable. <laughs> he sees me, and he smiles. Did you not get the point yesterday when I grilled you, man? Like, I'm not going to smile at you. So... Again, I grill him. He does the same thing today. I was pointing, whatever. It's been a week of this old man doing this, okay? I don't know what to do. <laughs> I don't know what to do. I feel like he's introducing my ass to everyone in that gym. <laughs> yeah, oh, look. You see that? You see that girl over there? 
See that white girl over there? Um, like, I don't even know. With that big butt? I don't want to be rude. I don't want to be rude because like, my mom always saw me respect your elders. I will always respect my elders. But I feel like now I'm being tested. Okay? I'm being tested. You're making me feel very uncomfortable. I feel like I can't even work out. Like, I got to do my cardio real quick and leave because it's just I don't feel right. I don't feel comfortable. And, like, I don't get it. Why do guys go to the gym to check out? Girls, go on, go on Google, go on Pornhub, go on, go on a porn site. I don't know, but we don't. We can talk about this later on my podcast. <laughs> like, go to the, go to a porn site where you can see, like, actual butt. My, I'm, like, in full-on <laughs> leggings, guys. Like, there is no skin showing when I go to the gym. Like, full-on. They want to see the real deal. Like, I don't get it. They want to see it jiggle in front of them, girl. Jiggle in front of them. It just makes me feel uncomfortable. It makes me feel like I can't work out when I'm there to work out. Like, I'm, I, I'm, no. Like, stop it. Stop it. Stop it right now. <laughs> it does make you feel uncomfortable. It's so annoying. I'm trying, but he's really testing me. Who knows what? What he thinks about. Ew. I don't even want to think about that. Mm -mm. No, no, thank you. I'll pass. Anybody want the avocado? The baby eats avocado. You can save it for her later. With her salmon. She fancy. She got avocado and salmon. My God. Comment down below what you guys think I should do. Either let the old man live or confront him and be like, back up, Gramps. Grimes stare a lot, all right? I'm just over it at this point. My am. Wow. Mm. Those frogs though, were bomb. I wish they put less salad and more flautas. I'm just saying. Mm -hmm. I didn't really ate the tacos then. My niece has it on my computer. <laughs> All right, my lovies. Don't forget, give this video two big thumbs up. No, don't forget to comment down below what you think I should do. Should I let the old man live and just let him stare away? Or should I confront Grant stare a lot? But don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend to join the fam bam. And until next time, remember, let's spread positive vibes, good laughs, and yummy eats. Peace.